tartlets just popped. <laughs> Try these a lot of supermarkets, you've seen them. I watched the uh, It film the other day. Mm. And you know when they put like scary suspenseful music in horror films and shit? Yeah. I swear at one point of it, it was a toaster popping up. Like, in, like it sounded like it a toaster. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, look, you see here, this one's not, because it's got a lot it's more in it. cookies it's not, in there. Yeah, it's not going to taste quite as, probably as bad as what it's the other one did. focusing on it, which is a bit shite. You're trying to block it out. Yeah, I'll have a bash. Again, yeah, Galaxy do cookies and cream, don't they? Cookie, cookie crunch. Yeah. It's just more the texture, isn't it? I'll grab the pot pot. I think, uh... <laughs> did, well, did it just fall did apart? Just broke in my hands, bro. I've got a camera in my hand, I don't know what you do. I don't think much of that cookies and cream chocolate either. It's nicer than the normal one, mm -hmm. but it's comparing it to Galaxy cookies. Fuck all, mate. I'm gonna get a sugar rush, man. I never eat this much chocolate and shit. He'll be bouncing off the fucking walls. <sighs> Alright, so that's it. Popped out the toaster. You can see just by cutting into it, it's gonna be that real quite sweet. I'm not even gonna do half, mate. Not even gonna do half. So uh you can see it's just like real creamy, like chocolate marshmallowy. It's not as sweet as what I thought it would be. Well, it's got a nice savoury taste to it. It's not as sweet as what I remember when I was a kid. You was having that for breakfast and shit, like. Mm, yeah, you wonder why I've got a this stone on me now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's not good for breakfast. Mm -mm. No, I mean, I try and stop my kids from eating things like Cocoa Pops for cereal, do you know what I mean? But um, I would not be able to have that for a snack. I wouldn't be able to have two of them for a snack now. Maybe when I was a kid, but not now. I think we might have burnt it a bit as well, <laughs> to be fair. Quite possibly, yeah. <laughs> but that's what happens in... Sue's house. Overcooked shit. Yeah, that's why I let my housemate cook. All right, let's do the butter finger. Yeah. And then we'll get onto the actual sweeties. The uh... Now this I'm excited about. Because it says, but Nestle. Yeah, we all know about Nestle, yeah. And who they support. Yeah, <laughs> do your knowledge. Do your research, Get learn, gain your knowledge. It says, uh, crispy, crunchy, peanut buttery. Do you like peanut butter? I love peanut butter. Again, another thing I used to do, like my mum would, would always um, almost be at work before I'd have to get up for school. She was hardly ever around but when I was young. I'd have my own breakfast, make my own breakfast and that. And sometimes, more often, I would just take a jar of peanut butter and eat a jar of, jar of peanut butter on the way to school. Because <laughs> then you wonder why. <laughs> I used to eat chocolate spread out there. Oh, I do that as well, yeah. Both in a sandwich together. Mm. Crunchy, it's got to have bits though. Let's see what but, it's yeah. saying. I'm guessing that it's going to be very similar to Reese's. Let's see what it's saying. So, it's been a poor show so far, America. Yeah, I mean, the present, it's sort of, oh, sort of, sort of reminds me of a Rocky bar. The fuck? Is that like an orange? Uh. Is it good? It's piff. <laughs> Is it? It's not healthy. But that tastes like, really sweet. That's just like pure sugar. The only thing I can like I've been on turkey, so obviously I know about as a toast we've grown up, you used to have some a pot of like spread and it was just literally like pure sugar. When you spread it it's just like turning into granules. Different flavours and that they put it on pita bread and that and have it for breakfast. Jesus. Really unhealthy. It sort of reminds me of that, sort of like that, and a bit like, you know, um, oh, honeycomb. Yeah. Very similar to honeycomb, but just pure peanut butter. Try some, bro. Oh, that's something a bit. Try it, oh, mate, I'm just gonna try another bit and then put it down. Well, 
I feel like peanut butter fun. I like Reese's cupcakes. I like Ben and Jerry's peanut butter ice cream and that. That's nice. It is exactly what it says on the packet. It is crispy. It is crunchy. And it is peanut buttery. Really nice. I feel uh, like I've got diabetes. Just already. I probably have before this show. <laughs> What's next, Mr. Wiles? See, Reese's Pieces, because that's peanut butter as well, isn't it? So. Yeah. The old Reese's Pieces. I've tried these before. These are what I was saying to AJ. Uh, Reese's, either pieces or cupcakes, the little one, round ones, and uh, Lint are my two favourite chocolates. But I can never turn turn them down. Even if I'm not in the mood for chocolate, I'll be in the mood for that motherfucker. Again, they just look like Smarties. Try one. Literally, just look like Smarties. They're the only colours that you get. They are Smarties, bro. Just peanut butter. Yeah. Then you know. the peanut butter kicks in. Look. Peanut butter filling. Not as nice as the cupcake though. I prefer the cupcake to the pieces. What do you think about them? No nah, man. You're not keen. They're nice, but I forgot to do the thing. What would you give the butter finger out of ten? The butter I'd give the butter finger out of ten. A ten? A ten, yeah. What about the Hershey's? The Hershey's, the plain, I'd give like a two. Not even that, a one, because it's fucking, you can buy that same type of chocolate for fucking 5p anywhere else, do you know what I mean? It's what, home brand. What about the, uh... the cookies and cream, I'd probably give about four, five. Same again, it's cheap chocolate, just tastes a little bit better. And the Reese's? The Reese's pieces, I'd give uh, an eight out of 10. I'd much rather the Reese's cupcakes. What about the Pop-Tarts? And the Pop-Tarts, I'm disappointed because I remember really enjoying having them for breakfast when I was a kid. They're a different flavour though to what you had. Yeah, I know, they had a chocolate flavour as well. But I mean, I'd, I'd give them like, I don't know, a six. Mm. S'mores. S'mores. Now... Very American. Yeah, I've never even seen these in my life, let alone heard of them or whatever. But we have had to bang the grill on. So, no, we uh, accidentally switched it off. You even even though, oh, we did, didn't we? That's alright. We'll get I'll back on it in a sec. Boom. Yeah, biscuits, chocolate and marshmallow. Gassed about it, I don't eat marshmallow because every single marshmallow product that we get in this country. <coughs> We're cooking s'mores, man. Cooking us some s'mores. Me souf. Mm. <laughs> Is it? Ooh. Don't burn the s'more, bro. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, mmm, smells nice. Fucking hell, bro, you, you toasted it. What are you doing that to it for? To fucking make it all fucking melt quicker. I'm impatient. See, Aaron thought he was impatient waiting for the camera to charge up, but I'm more impatient when it comes to munch. That'll probably do, you know, as long as it'll squish in there. Oh. Yeah, I think that's probably about done. Mmm. Be soof. Fire. Warm. Mm. Yeah? Cracker. Chocolate. Oh, wow. Messy business. Marshmallow. Sandwich. <laughs> squirt. Now. I'm gassed about this because I don't have a chance to eat marshmallows often because most of it, like I said earlier, port gelatine. Come on, get it down your neck. Should I try and go in one go? Yeah. Oh, it's know. hot. Is it hot? Hmm, why? Out of ten. I'll give it an eight. Eight out of ten for the s'mores. If anyone buys these, yeah. Maybe do the marshmallow a little bit longer. Make the fucking chocolate melt a bit. But 8 out of 10. Alright, we're coming to the last sweet now. Just before we have the last sweet, just want to shout out to everyone that's been watching Sooth so far. Yeah, one love, it's all love. Thanks for all the support. And make sure you uh, click that subscribe button and give us a thumbs up. And any comments that you'd like to see on Sooth so far in the future or different shit to do, just let us know. And let we'll us do know it. and we'll do it. 
So brings it, us down to our last one. Oh, and look out for the episode coming out on Thursday featuring episode three, the Shrives. It's funny. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. Featuring um, Josh and Henry from the Shrives out Thursday at 8 p.m. Sharpish. On to Rainbow Nerds. I remember these being big when I was a kid. Sort of like millions. It's cracking uh, before we. I think the difference between these and millions is I remember them being, oh no, these are all separate, uh, all together. Look at that. All yeah, that colour. Just like min millions. Just like millions. Only millions you'll only get one bag of one type, wouldn't you? But these are all different flavours mixed together. And they're sour. Oh, Jesus. Bang them all in one go. So much flavour, isn't there? <laughs> all the different flavours, it's all sour. If you want to get your uh, your grandkids, or even your kids, hyped up and give them back to the missus or their mum and dad, that will definitely do the job. No <laughs> doubt. Sour as fuck. Yeah, really sour. I'll rate these. I rate these. I like these better than Minions. They're more crunchy than Minions. Minions are chewy. These ain't. These are sour as fuck. Get your juices flowing. Keeps your mouth all nice and moist. On that note, I'm going to say one love, people. Thanks for uh, watching this special edition of Sue Sofa. Any suggestions, please holler at us. One love. It's Peace. goodbye from him, and it's goodbye from me. If I don't see you fruit week, see you fruit window.